Hello, you two. Martin and Randy, hi. Hello, Robert. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet both of you. Where are you? We're in Denmark. Okay, good. Uh, Andy's just recently introduced me to this uh, spirituality. Uh, so I'm, uh, this is a new world for me. Okay. Um, I have realized that I'm missing, I have missing uh, something in my life. A meaning or the meaning of my life. I miss something that I can lean into and be supported by or be comforted by. I long for the feeling of being home. Uh, so my questions are, can you help me? And uh, if yes, how do I do? Uh, I'm a practical guy. I would love if you had a recipe, you know, like A, do this, B, do this, and 20 minutes in the oven and then I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> well, Martin, I'm a practical guy too, um, but I don't, I don't really have a a recipe, quite in the way that you suggest. Um, but but I have suggestions and pathways um, that I can suggest to you, and and in fact, that's what I've been doing these these last three or four days, three days. Um, providing uh, different pathways because we're all there, there are lots of us here we're all very very different some pathways resonate with some people some with with others so I'm always trying to develop new pathways tailor my pathways more and more specifically to the the person or the situation so so, but, so let's let, 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 let me address your, your question that directly. Uh, first of all, and I think you, you've intuited this, that the home that you want uh, is something inside you. It, it can never come from the outside. Anything that comes from the outside will sooner or later leave you. That, 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 that's, a, that's just a law, it's a fact. So if you want a, a place of refuge, a place of peace, a place of safety. You you must look for it in yourself. I I don't mean to imply in any way that it's not valid to have a, a, a loving long term relationship, to have a home, to look after it, to have a these these are there can still be long term projects in your life, but to invest your desire for peace and happiness in them will sooner or later lead to to failure to suffering so i think you've already intuited this the home that you're looking for is is in yourself now when you look in yourself you find a jumble of thoughts, images, memories, feelings, sensations, perceptions, uh, etc. So wh what in all of this um, internal experience is, is reliable, safe, secure? Well, it's obviously not your thoughts, your feelings, your sensations. These are changing all the time. You have no idea what the next experience is going to be but there is one element of yourself that is absolutely rock solid stable consistent ever present and that is your being or the fact of being aware that is the stable element of experience that's your home so the next question is, how do I how do I recognize that? How do I how do I get in touch with that? And the way to do so, or the way to one way to to start is by going into yourself and discarding everything that is not essential to you, the not totally reliable. You're obviously not going to take refuge in your thoughts because your thoughts are 
changing or they're unstable. Likewise, your feelings, your sensations, everything, all the content of your experience is changing and unstable. But there's one element of yourself, just the, just the fact of being aware or awareness, the awareness with which you know your experience. That is rock solid. It is your essential identity or self. It's the one element of your experience that cannot be removed from you. Can you relate to what I'm saying in your experience? Yes, I can. Okay. So the, the thing to do, Martin, is just to keep going back there. To begin with, you may it may take some time as you travel back through the layers of your experience. You may have to walk yourself back until you come till you come to this your your essential irreducible self or being just the fact of being aware what you are aware of is always changing fleeting unstable appearing and disappearing but that which is aware is always present, stable, unchanging. That is your refuge. It is always at peace. So it's in the background of experience. And it is always in, at peace. And actually, it, it, its nature is peace and happiness. Does that give you enough to, to make, a big, make a start? Yes, yes, it will make it, it will make a start for me. Thank you. Okay, I wish you the best. Nice to see you both.